What's up, IHS? I'm your host, Tobias Kurzweil. And I'm Francis Clem. This week we talk about College Sean Bagels moving, the Seneca Falls rally, a new housing complex, and the IHS spikeball tournament. CTB will be relocating its college town location across the street. Why? The current store is in an old building and the owners say they would rebuild into a newer space. CTB will move to Sheldon Court, which was previously a private boys' dormitory. The owners, Gregor Brous and Mimi Mahaffey, say they will redesign the new CTB by incorporating history in unnamed new twists and also a space in the back for people to rent out. In honor of the building's history, the owners say they will name a sandwich the Sheldon after moving. On January 18th, thousands of people met at Seneca Falls. Why there? Because Seneca Falls is where the first women's rights convention was held. The original Seneca Falls convention happened in 1848 and launched a women's suffrage movement. In the past few months, 15 women planned this event. One representative from the group states, It was pretty easy because we did designate Seneca Falls as the epicenter of all the national celebrations of the 100th anniversary of our right to vote. End quote. People from all over the country came to celebrate this event and echo the point that we can do better. I think it's really cool that this historical landmark that people travel from all around the country to see is less than an hour away. Developers are planning a new housing complex along the Hugo Lake Inlet. The project is called City Harbor and it is designed to provide Ithaca's waterfront with housing and recreation. The new plan relies on Ithaca's waterfront plan, which passed last November and allows for bigger development of the waterfront area. Costa Lambro from the Ithaca-based Lambro Real Estate claims City Harbor will include 156 residential units, boating and golfing amenities, and a medical center, as well as other features. The project is expected to create 75 to 100 full-time jobs. Hey to IHS! This February, Captain's Council will be hosting their first annual Spike Ball Tournament. This tournament will be held on Saturday, February 15th at 1 p.m. in Bliss Gym. The cost will be $5 for a partnership and $3 for an individual. All experience levels are welcome. Rules will be reviewed at the tournament, so do not worry if you need a refresher. There will be prizes. Sign up online before February 10th, then pay at the door. The link is, uh, to sign up is in the description below. Well, that's all for this week, I adjust. See you next time. I hope we're recording this. We need this for credit, Gina.